welcome back to the greenhouse here today thought maybe I would start a little kind of a semi instructional video on how to cover a greenhouse uh, this greenhouse behind me here was built in 2001 so uh, and this just happens to be its year uh, to get a new cover and I thought I would take you all through the process so if, there, if there's anyone out there uh, that's learning and, and wanting to see how to do and, and how we do it uh, perhaps it could be a help to you We've learned a lot over the last 20 years uh, on how to make it a little easier, uh, how to avoid certain problems that we know are gonna come up, and uh, maybe this will help you just a little bit. So this greenhouse, uh, like I say, was built in 01. This will be its fourth covering, and every six years uh, we, we, cover, uh, we recover a greenhouse. That's covered with poly polyethylene, and uh, it's really a, considered a four-year plastic. Uh, but I can get six out of it without any problems. I could probably get more than that out of it But when it gets a little bit older, it kind of changes the way that the light uh, Goes through it and uh, I can actually see a little bit of a difference in plant growth and how they perform the older the plastic gets So we stick with six years and so far that's worked really well for us So I guess the first thing that we're going to do here today is kind of go around the outside and just clean up clean up inside and uh, this is just kind of an introdu introductory video, so it's really not going to have a whole lot else to it. But over the next few weeks, we were going to try to cover this greenhouse this week. Uh, and then we heard uh, 50 mile an hour winds, and that changed my mind. So uh, that's something that we'll probably go over just a little bit later on. So we thought we would share this with you. I hope it will help somebody. And if you have any questions about it, just leave, uh, leave your questions there in the comments. So thank you all for watching. We'll catch up with you on the next video.